Okay, this is Marina One. Mm -hmm. There's four marinas in Santa Barbara Harbor. This is the largest one, has the access to it. It holds almost 600 boats, and it's by marina standards, by current standards, it's, it's really quite large. It's a lot of boats to have in one single marina with a single access. The docks you're looking at now, the main walk, is brand new, but it has 16 fingers with about 30 to 40 boats each, and they were built in the 1970s, and they were kind of gone beyond their useful life. So we started a 10-phase program to replace them. And uh, we did it in 10 phases for a couple different reasons. One was kind of to sp spread out the cost over several different years. It's a pretty expensive project, and we can build one phase at a time and incrementally get to a new docking system with, with uh, just minor adjustments to our revenues. And um, the first thing started was the main walk right here. And if you can just stand over here, you can look straight down the main walk. That's the, the main access to all the boats in Reno 1. And they, uh, we hired a contractor to go and, and replace this whole thing. They built a brand new docking system right along the side. It took them several months, and then on one day, they took the old docks out and moved the new docks in. And that was the first phase of the project. So the subsequent phases have been like one or two dock finger docks at a time. So we've finished the phase two and phase three just this last year. Even to this day, if there was a bad southeaster, you could go out to the end of the harbor and the docks would move around quite a bit in a large mm -hmm. storm. So for 30 years, that's how it was for O&P fingers, and um, it just really got beat up. And if you look at some of the older docks, every single dock has cracks and chips out of the concrete that we repair on a constant basis. The structural element is what we call wooden whalers along the side that hold the docks, the concrete docks together they break and split, so we're constantly repairing those. If we didn't repair them as aggressively as we do, this, this marina would have been unusable 10 years ago, at least. So with an aggressive maintenance program, you can kind of keep a docking system up and functional, but at some point it gets just, it's, it's too much maintenance and you just can't do it anymore. The concrete just deteriorates and they fall apart. You'll see to the right, You'll, you can obviously see the difference. It's just pretty obvious that the docks are new. There's new dock boxes, new electrical, everything's, everything's new. It's very secure and stable in storm, so it's a, it's a significant upgrade. And, it's, and this will last 30, 40 years at least.